and welcome to lesson three of cricket. We're going to focus on batting. So if you have a cricket bat at home, then you will need to use it. If you don't have a cricket bat, you can use a tennis racket and it will be similar to the skills we're doing. For your warm-up, I want you to see how many times you can keep the cricket ball in the air and count your score. And I want you to try and post on Satchel how many you got in a row. If you want a bit more of a challenge, you can try and use the side of the cricket bat. If you're using the tennis racket, you can hit it with one side and turn it over and hit it with the other. So you might start here and then see how many you can do with the side or edge of the cricket bat. So today we're going to focus on the forward drive. It's the shot you, most play, um, you play most in cricket, mainly to protect your stumps and it's a safety shot. It's always going to stay on the floor and it always goes straight past the bowler hopefully and you can get some runs. So if you have more than one tennis ball or small ball use that okay and you're just going to put them in a line. I'm going to show you the skill first of all and then you can try and hit the ball against the wall or if you've got a family member at home who wants to try and field the ball or throw you the ball you can do that. So you're going to stand side on. I'm going to show you left handed because I am and then I'll show you the right handed way. So you're going to stand, up, stand about half a metre away from the ball okay you're going to make sure you hold the bat if you don't know how to hold the bat you hold up two v's with your hands so your dominant hand will be higher up than your non-dominant hand and then you just bend down and pick up the bat and that's how you hold it so if you're right-handed your right hand goes on the top left hand on the bottom and you hold it so you will then stand half a meter away and as you play the shot a bit like when you field, you're going to have your foot as close to the ball as possible. Once you've done that, you're going to keep your head down, weight over, and hit the ball. I'll just show you right-handed. I don't know if you want to go in that way. So, half a metre away again. This isn't going to be as good because it's my weak hand. Foot as close to the ball, lean forward, and hit. So, once you've tried a few times from hitting from the floor, or from someone throwing the ball to you, you can drop it from your own height. So you have the bat in your strongest hand ready, and with your not your weak hand, you can just drop the ball. You can let it bounce once or twice, and then try and hit it against the wall. make this shot attacking and you can do that by hitting it over the bowler's head and trying to aim for a straight six or four. I'm going to show you the defensive way first of all which we've just done and then how to progress it into an attacking shot. So with a defensive shot you always take a big stride. That's because your weight gets over the ball so you're always naturally going to push at the ball with your hands. So I'll quickly show you that. So your weight is always forward. If you want to make it attacking, you go from a big stride to a small stride, and then instead of getting all the way over the ball, you're going to use your arms to power through the shot. So it's a bit like a swinging action. So you would go watch the ball, small step, and strike. I'll show you that one again. two shots we're going to focus on is the sweep shot and the pull shot and it's basically you're going to play it into the wall so if you're left-handed you're going to step across and play it there if you're right-handed you're going to step across and play it to that side so always make sure you're stood on the side you're going to hit the balls so make sure you're stood against the wall so the type of delivery depends on what shot you play so if the ball is bounced low you can play a sweep shot so you can hold it out in front of you, let it bounce, and then try and hit it. So, a sweep shot is where you're low to the floor, your knee might even be on the floor, and you're going to go from high to low. If you want to play the sweep, um, the pull shot, sorry, you're going to throw the ball a bit higher in the air, you might even drop, um, throw it up. So you throw it up, you stay on your feet, and play. So the difference between the two shots is the height. 
So if it's bold high, stay on your feet, high to low. If it bounces low, on the floor, high to low. I'll show you two more examples. So high delivery, step and play. Low delivery. 